Yo, what's going on? What I'm going to show you in this video is going to change your production life and save you so much time in FL Studio 20. So don't go away. Let's get into it. If you don't know who I am, I'm Jay Carter Ray from jcarterray.com teaching you how to be better at YouTube marketing, online business and music production. And this is the number one spot for creatives and musicians that don't want to be starving artists because I'm going to teach you how to build your business, market yourself and get better at your craft. That's what this is all about. Let's do this. In this video, I'm going to basically show you how to separate all these channels in the same pattern to different patterns really, really quickly. Now, usually what I used to do when I was creating a beat is I would create the whole beat here. So I'd have the claps, the hi-hats, the snares, the open hats, all that sort of stuff, and just have it all here. And then I'd cut it and move every single, you know, every single channel to a different pattern so that I can arrange the song. But you don't have to do that. And you know, these days I just, I just arrange from the song in the beginning, but that's besides the point. It's very easy to actually get all of these channels to their own pattern without having to copy it or cut it and go to each pattern one by one, which is just really long for me personally, because I, I guess I don't know all the shortcuts to get to the next pattern and all that sort of stuff. But let me show you how to do it. So let's select the channel rack and then we'll go to patterns. And then we just want to go to split by channel. And as you can see, all the patterns that we had are now named and they are available for us to now arrange the song and it was just in literal seconds not even in seconds to be honest it was probably a mini seconds it's done now we're done we can arrange the track now we have everything that we need here we can get rid of the channel rack you don't need to see that anymore we've got everything we need here we can select this remember control and left click to select stuff if you haven't watched my video on the 11 FL Studio shortcuts that you need to know. Go watch that. You'll learn a lot of great stuff over here. But now what we can do is we can just copy this over and then we can create our arrangement however we want to do it. We can start bringing in things one by one, uh, maybe bring in, you know, another thing. And then, you know, this is the chorus or something. We'll just give them a little bit, of, give it a little bit of space before the chorus comes in. What's the, uh, that's why that's happening. So, we can give it a little bit of space before the chorus comes in and then yo chorus drops whatever obviously this is a dead beat and i just put all this sort of stuff together to basically show you that this is possible this I, this isn't real real arrangement this is a real beat um so please do not judge me on whatever you see here i just wanted to show you how to split your patterns by channel so that you can get everything into its own pattern and start arranging your song and do that in seconds instead of spending you know minutes copying things to next patterns and then sometimes when i'll do that i'd miss out a pattern or I'd, I'd cut something and then forget about it and then i'd have to go through like a lot of different uh, tasks to undo it to the right place so that i still have the same pattern and it's just long it's just long this is the best way to do it this is straightforward this is the way to do it if you're producing all your stuff in one pattern do this at the end it color codes everything it names it the right thing and then you can easily see what's going on in the actual song arrangement so i really really like this if i was still producing that way then i'd still be using it but now because i just i just fling my stuff in the actual track and then loop it and then produce around that so that i can hear how the song's progressing and that sort of stuff so i personally don't use this anymore but this is probably very very useful to you very very useful this will change your life if you didn't know about it before but that's not all i've also got a lot of helpful resources available for you in the description down below so definitely go and check out the description there's a bunch of links in there that will help you out you'll learn all the equipment that i use for my music as well as you can gain access to you know my beats my sound kits my drum kits whatever all that sort of stuff will be in the description and yeah if you want to learn the five most important steps to youtube success there's a free course link in the description that will teach you that and give you the answers to the steps that i took to get to where i'm at where i'm able to create what i want and do what i want and create a full-time living from my youtube channel so if you don't want to be a starving artist and you want to learn how to monetize your craft 
and build a real business instead of chasing views and all that sort of stuff and build a real audience, then sign up for that course. And you'll also be added to my daily email list where I'm dropping daily germs, daily stories, daily information to help you get cl closer to your goals and get to where you wanna be. So if you're interested in that, sign up down below. Besides that, question of the day, is how do you produce? Do you, do you lay everything out in one pattern? Yeah, like I used to do. Or are you producing in the song arrangement playlist? Let me know, let me know. Cause that's really interesting. I wanna see what other people's workflow is or what your workflow is. I think it'll be really interesting to find out to see maybe if I can steal, steal a couple things from you, make my workflow a little bit better. You know how it is right here? I'm hoping I share some things with you. You share some things with me. We both get better. It's all happy days. So yeah, that is the end of the video. In the next video, you'll learn more about YouTube marketing, online production, and <laughs> online production, online business, and music production. I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.